Here we go, the tail of the tape. My little soft spot, Corey, the crazy cowboy Smith from Victoria, is taking on Jacob James Richards. Murph, I don't know a lot about Jacob. Corey's as tough as they come down, Victoria. What can you tell me about Jacob? Well, mate, listen, he's a very um, underestimating looking sort of a kid. He's, uh, mate, just seems to be one of these kids that pulls it off. He's out of it, it's the only thing, all right? Let's go, boys, let's rock and roll. You're right, big man. Let's go. Get some bump. Let's box. Okay, round number one. one. Proudly sponsored by Ultra Tune, Logan Law, Dig Sybil and Martin, excuse me, and Radio Metro. Oh. Yeah, I can see what you're saying, mate. He's very, very strong. Good. Stands in the front and just, yeah, Corey, just unloads strong punches, strong kicks, everything. Oh, he just got this knack where he just walks people down. As you can see, he's just walking forward. Doesn't mind a bit of punishment either. Yeah, no, very strong you can see. Very, very strong in his stance. Jacob, um, Jacob doing well and moving around there. Though, yeah. you know? Very good. No, that's what he's got to do. Jacob's got to just throw those punches and kicks and use those angles. Keep moving, keep moving. Don't stand there. Make him, uh, make Corey chase him and make him miss like he just did. Correct. Now, one thing, Murph, I will say. Corey cannot fall into the trap of automatically having the mindset this is a five-round fight. It is a three-round fight, which changes a lot, as you know, in a Muay Thai bout. No, exactly, mate. And obviously coming from uh, his gym that he does down there, and, um, you know, they are very, very good. Don Miller, very, very Thai boxing style. Jacob just throwing a beautiful teep, knocking Corey down there. And once again, Murphy, you've caught this very, very well and early. Jacob is moving around on his feet a lot and really offsetting Corey, he cannot walk him down very well at the moment. No, no he can't. And this is what I'm saying. He's very up, upsetting. Um, you know, he, he, he just does that move, move, punch, kick, punch, kick, move, move. And, and against a strong Thai boxing style fighter, that yeah, walks up, it makes it very hard because he can't get settled. The question for me is, will Jacob have the fitness to do it for three rounds? Murph? As you know, being active like that, moving yep. around, does take a lot of energy. Yeah, but every fight he's had, mate, he, he, he does. You know, he's only a young kid himself, so he, he has got that fitness with him, and he does train hard. He does a lot of sparring up at NTG. Um, beautiful, beautiful combination, hand punching there. Using the angles too, switching away, beautiful. Kind of like uh, the commentary box here, Murph. It's Queensland versus Victoria. <laughs> That's it, mate. That's it. Maybe we should have a show. No, you'll beat the crap out of me. <laughs> Especially if those movies have come out, mate. You'll be right there. <laughs> oh, lands a beautiful right hand, then. Jacob starting to be ever so slightly more still, except for them. Beautiful step out, low kick. Oh, yeah. I have yeah. seen Corey pop and an abundance of punishment before, mate, and still walk forward. So, ooh, oh, yes, that one there. you gotta, you got to give him time for that one. Well, mate, I can see it now at the moment now. Um, I think Jacob definitely up here at the moment. Just just frustrating him a bit, but like you say, let's see how it goes round two and round three. Always oh, back on. Jacob sticking with that nice long tip. Corey chasing. Yeah. Nice body, just nice body print right latch there. On. We can both see what Corey's trying to do. He just can't latch on. No, but he did hurt him with that leg kick Now He's rushing through oh, it a little oh, bit of frustration. Oh, no, no. That's him, right? You know where to go. And end of round one. Well, Murphy, you have called that very early on, and I, I could not say it, say it was called any better. Jacob stuck and move, stuck and move. Very well done. Yeah, no, definitely, mate. Uh, I think it was very good, uh, you know, cornering once again. He's letting him know, mate, don't stand there. He is going to put the pressure on. Keep using those angles. Hold centre ring. Don't get caught up on the ropes. Round two. Here we go. Well, beautiful right hand then landed by Corey. Oh, pounders him back. Oh, I think it might have rocked Corey there a little bit, mate. Beautiful slip under there by Jacob. Catching Corey with a right hand there, mate. Yes. Now he's definitely trying to walk it up on him now. Um, so we'll see whether the pressure comes. That Jake has definitely got to move, got to move, hit and move, hit and move, hit and move. Oh, yeah, don't stand there, mate, because obviously the power that comes through from Corey and those leg kicks are starting to hurt. Oh, well, yeah, and Corey is a very, very strong individual. Yeah, no, you can see that, mate. He's, he's, uh, I'm actually very impressed with the power that he produces, you know, very strong in his stance and just 
unrelenting. Oh, big yeah. hook there. Now, Murph, I know there's a thousand things going on in the ring at once for any fighter, but I'd love to see Corey try and use his ring craft a little bit better. Yes. And try and steer Jacob into a corner and be ever so aware of when he is in the corner like that. And see how he's back down and slipped down? Love to see Corey control his aggression a little bit more in and get him towards the corner. No, mate, 100%. I think he needs to sort of drop down in that power a bit and relax a little bit more, like you say, and just move with him. And then soon as, like he is now, wait for him to attack, then put the power on. Very true. Now, I don't know if you've seen right. that contrast of low kicks there. Corey took Lock. that one, no problem, fired one back at yeah. Jacob, and Jacob only folded. Yes, mate, he did. Those leg kicks are hurting. See, this is where he should be after those push kick now power kick you know and really make jacob pay and that'll slow jacob up oh there, there that is. is nice that's it as he punches forward boom but yeah i've got it that the thing is jacob's landed a lot more than him both legs are fucking <laughs> getting a little bit excited there man <laughs> No, I had to throw one in somewhere, but well, you know, we're only on live <laughs> with Fox. Fox. I'm sure they'd forgive the Murph for, yeah, for no. your many, many years of sacrifice and your body <laughs> and your refereeing skills. <laughs> Corey has Jacob on the ropes. This is where he wants him. Starting to pound away the legs, but once again, Jacob yeah, steered off. Just, it, yeah, Jacob's definitely our point in the Corey's walking it up and more powerful, but Jacob's just scoring the punches and scoring the kicks. Now, just before we've seen the uh, the ducks fly over Murph, you're about to point out that uh, Jacob is hitting that lead leg of Corey's more often, so he yes. is doing damage. And oh, Corey, <laughs> try the big flying knee. Yeah, box. yeah and as you know, mate, it's, it doesn't matter that you could be kicked there very softly, but if you kick there a hundred times, mate, it's going to hurt. Very, very true, mate. Mate, I, I'm, I, I think I'm still going to have to be favouring Jacob at the moment. I reckon you're right, Murph. I, I just think he's frustrated Corey too much and outpointed him so far. Don't throw him off the robot. Yeah. Don't throw him off the robot. He's seeing what we're seeing, mate. He's got to win this round, and I believe he's got to stop him or get an eight count to um, bring it home. Took the words right out of my uh, word. Uh, what do you call it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Oh, oh beautiful big knee there, that jaw. Oh, don't yes. get quite rock, Jacob, though. No, he's uh, definitely coming through with a bit of a. Corey just showing us about a leg there. Man. <laughs> yeah. Thank Christ that he's wearing undies tonight. <laughs> Uh, who said working with you would be boring? <laughs> uh, he can keep his little bojangles to himself, mate. <laughs> Corey stalking his opponent still. Don Miller will be livid. Mate, oh, I can definitely see. Mate, look at it, just scoring. Leg kick, leg kick, leg kick. You know, yeah. he's waiting. And now, yeah. Don is instructing when he gets this clinch to knee straight away, <laughs> which he doesn't do. He's not happy. No, I think he's, he's frustrated and he's trying to show the dominance. And this is what young Jacob does, mate. That's what I said. He's very... He just, he just seems to pull it off every time. Very active, like you said, man. Very active. Corey's tried to catch that tape a few times now, and he just manages to keep slipping out. Yeah, of it. and as he moves in, look, you see young Jacob, beautiful with these kicks. He comes in, you know, catching him, catching him, you know. I know he's going to be a sore boy if he makes it through, mate. It's, um, and this is the thing of those super eights, isn't it? 100%, man. So much body yeah. damage is being absorbed. Yep. Yeah, you can see now he's look, he's going to push kick. Everything's in twos and threes from young Jacob. And uh, I think Corey at the moment just, just frustrated. Yeah, look, punch and kick, push kick. That is a beautiful display of Jacob. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Oh, the the jaw on. <laughs> yes, he won. Testing out his tenure again on Corey's face. <laughs> uh, yeah, and catching him now. You can see the frustration in Corey's face. It's just been very, very... Very, very repetitive, Jacob, but it's actually worked for him. It's just stepped out through the left hand and shot the leg, and it's worked dozens yeah. and dozens of times. That's right, yeah, constantly. Come on, Chuck. Just calling them on. Yeah. No, I, I think um, Corey's probably uh, thinking to himself, he knows he's lost it. 
The last time I seen Jacob, he was a, a young fellow at Boonja. There it is, left hook to right, low kick again, though. Yeah. Uh, he didn't have the body development uh, that I see in the upper body now. He looks like he's starting to actually develop a bit of a manly body as he yeah, goes back to the again. face. Uh, mate, yeah, just a beautiful display. Ring craft, the good ring movement, using that push kick just to perfection. Look again. Box, box. Jacob actually looks very, very fit to him. Though, yeah, and as I said, he's a young kid. He does train hard and, um, you know, he has moved oh. around. Yeah, beautiful again. Just that the kick... Can't get a better display of push kicks. Hey, what if Jacob keeps Corey in the yep. face one more time? He might have a <laughs> foot Yeah. If he starts sucking his toes next, mate, we've got something to worry about. <laughs> oh, a great display of respect there from Jacob to Corey. Well done. As we go to the replay, oh, look as at he's that. seen, it just slips out of Corey's grasp, which was a very frustrating thing for us. Or, for, sorry, Corey. <laughs> I have to call him Houdini, mate. Yeah, one minute he's here, next minute he's gone. Yeah, look Seat at that beautiful the face. Yeah, no, beautiful display. Look at that. Oh, well timed. Again. Oh. I'll tell you what, you can ask Corey what size feet Jacob's got. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we've gone to the judges' scorecards. Your winner and moving forward to semi final number two, red corner, Jacob Richard.